market grow every single year. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if we, if we saw the market now leave over Gay Street and head north on uh, Pearl, or for that matter, uh, leave across uh, Third Street and go east on, on Lynn. I've been to cities like Los Angeles where these, these open air markets literally go for 20 and 30 linear blocks. We may very well see the kind of growth you know, you know, the market really does several things. I mean, it is an attraction for downtown employees. Um, but it is also a place to incubate new businesses. And, uh, and we've seen three, three market vendors now sign leases for uh, permanent retail space. The other thing the market does is it supports the retail uh, uh, folks that are already in the alley. It's such a great market right downtown. There's over 41,000 uh, employees within a 10 block radius. And this is the best way that I could expose the masses to our little boutique uh, European artists of bread. It's uh, my first year here, and we uh, will we'll definitely be here for the next several years. Uh, we like the way that the crowd comes in and goes out. And uh, right downtown, Columbus, you can't beat it. It's great. Yeah, it's fun. Um, they're great products here. The produce, you can't beat the produce that you get at the market. And uh, a lot of the merchandise is, uh, is stuff that people find interesting. All of Orchard has been part of the Pearl Market for two years now. We were here last summer and we're here this summer. We'll be here through October. And uh, we just love coming to Pearl Market because it's a great way to connect with downtown Columbus and we don't have our products for sale to people who like them. My dream for the market is that we begin to get some permanent retail set up in the alleys and that the, the permanent retail feeds off of the temporary retail we get uh, on these uh, Tuesday and Friday markets. Um, and then we, we see the market not only grow uh, uh, geographically, but we start to see uh, extension of hours, maybe more than two days a week, uh, maybe longer hours during the days that the uh, temporary market set up. But, but to see an interaction there between permanent retail and temporary retail is really where this thing needs to go.